What's up guys, TKS HD Plus here in 720p HD right here on YouTube. I've got a little prank for you guys to pull on some of your friends. Uh, it's using Notepad, it uses scripts. Uh, what it does is you can put, um, make error messages, they're totally fake, you can make different types of them, and uh, you can make a shutdown thing at the end. And it's really cool. I've got a uh, preset right here that I'm going to post to my website. You can even name it like virus.vbs, and here's what it is. You can uh, edit it, and this is what the code is. I put this as uh, the code, and what it is is x equals message box, in parentheses, quote, and then type in what you want to say right here where I put error message, your computer has been infected with the Trojan horse virus. I know that sounds generic, but okay. Once you're done with that, put an end quote right there. Now you can put different uh, codes for like 4 plus 12. There's different types. Experiment with some of them. You get different icons or different types of message box. Some of them don't work, but keep on trying. Usually even numbers work the most. Make sure they're multiples. Multiples work the best. And right here, the finishing quote will be the title and then in parentheses. So once you've got that, you can save it as a .vbs file. Do sorry what we're gonna do is we're gonna uh, save it as TKS virus and make sure that's set to all files and put dot VBS at the end click save go into your desktop and click oh, let's see where it is right here uh, it'll be right here oh there it is TKS virus dot VBS so once you open up the uh, tksvirus.vbs file that I have right there, that'll bring up that warning box that says error message, your computer's been infected with the Trojan horse virus. And if you keep on actually clicking OK, it'll just actually keep popping up. See this? Check that out. Now at the end, you can try and you know, experiment with some code and see what you can find out to maybe get a shutdown virus with it. Uh, which I'm going to show you right up next. See how you can get it to link to the .bat file that I'm about to show you to create. And then that's about it. Then you're pretty much done. So let me show you how to create that shutdown .bat file right now. Alright, so now what you're going to do is you're going to open up Notepad again. I'm just going to type it in here, get it open. Now this is a shutdown trick. Most of you already know this, but I'm going to put it up again, I know. But it, you just have to type in the simple code. It's S-U-A-S-H-U-T-D-O-W-N, shutdown, dash S, dash F. What that does is that shut down, shut down, force. So that's going to force you to shut down in less than a minute. It's going to count down from one minute. Now, I'm using Vista, so I don't know the code exactly for the message, but I can tell you that on Vista this does work. It gives you a little tiny message that says you have less than a minute before your computer is going to log you off and shut you down. Uh, that's how I know it's, uh, that works. Uh, but what you can do is you click File, Save As. You click All Files again. And we're going to call this Shutdown virus but you're gonna rename it like Internet Explorer or something dot b a t has to be a dot bat file because it's, it's a batch file and it's gonna enter that into command prompt you're gonna save that that's saved onto my desktop and it's right here now I can't show you it because that will shut down my computer and I can't do the screen recording in less than one minute so uh, now you can however if you activated it you can go into command prompt and type in shutdown dash s dash a that will make the uh, shutdown abort that's there you go now I'll come up with that but once you have the uh, other one in it will um, shut down the one that's already running that's forcing it to so that's it for TKS HD right now. I'm making another Windows 7 video pretty soon. So uh, keep posted, subscribe, rate, and comment. Please, 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 please. I'm looking forward to 25 subscribers pretty soon. So please help me out there. Okay, thanks. See you later.